Oh, my brother! Die!
won't be gentle if they spot me. The festival is underway. I should speak to Rolo about our plan. I should be cautious around here. Good morrow! Good morrow! I stand here on behalf of the Lady Alette of Colchester, famed mistress of the flight. Do you seek an audience? I've never heard of her. Based on your appearance, I'm thoroughly unsurprised. Nevertheless, do you wish to challenge her? I do. Foolish. Yet to be graced by her presence may balance the pain of the loss you will most assuredly suffer. Lady Elette, you are called to the field of flighting. Ah, oh, a peasant. Come for a sound flighting. Please, place your paltry bet. Take this. A pittance. But I accept on the lady's behalf. She will begin. I have heard much about you, and none of it good. You've the softness and brains of a sheep. My verses are known all across this great land. For they put all who hear them to sleep. Not bad. Oh, you think you're so clever, I'm almost impressed that you managed to blurt something out. Yet I worry our skills are too deeply mismatched. I'll defeat you and banish all doubt. <laughs> Lucky. I should almost take pity on one so bereft, of beauty, of wit, and of skill. But instead, I'll persist till you beg me to stop. Lend a soul, for your words make me ill. Where did you steal that one from? Thus the Lady Alette has been beaten at last, by the one she was foolish to doubt. Now her herald must give me the sum of my bet, while Alette can but stand there and pout. Oh, pay what is due and send this peasant away. I grow weary. Of course, milady. Take your winnings, you have earned them. Thank you. about this lap, my friend.
truth is you fear to me. So the queen may do this before fortune. The heaven of the dawn. Hey, they used to sacrifice John Barleycorn so that his seed might fall on the fertile land and grow the grain anew. I don't care for that pagan pump. There is just one god now, and he gives us everything we need in this life and the next. <laughs> Few us in the world, Nichorade. They never when that to Christ. Rather bear us, bear us, we hear the old wolf, head on us. Messages. Ah, near Sorga Bitham. Vija. My head is spinning with the mead and fires. I might even dance a jig or two. Lamas is like honey. Luscious and sweet. A night to get lost in the pure joy of life and a good harvest. Brant was meat era to Sarahe. Let us swaying air. We hog us through, though as well, be lost not wary. Was it battle was done? My head is spinning with the mead and fires. I might even dance a jig or two. Lamas is like honey, luscious and sweet. A night to get lost in the pure joy of life and a good harvest. I wanted to wear a garland of meadow sweet in my hair. They say it will bring you your true love. Well, let's dance. Then perhaps you will see he's been beside you all along. Yield and win and shilling, keening it. Then be sure, and then up Odysseus, if you walk. How are your people, Rolo? Recovered and ready for what tonight holds? Gerhild's treachery was a blow. Few were surprised it came to that, only that her dark ways took such a brutal turn. Put that aside. We're ready now. What would you have of us? Wait for my signal. When I approach Estrid, that is your time. I am your axe, Eivor. Night will fall soon. Then is our moment to strike. Hmm. <laughs> they used to sacrifice John Barleycorn so that his sweat might fall on the fertile land and grow the grain in you. I don't care for that pagan pomp. There is just one god now, and he gives us everything we need in this life and the next. <laughs> Wait up. They used to sacrifice John There is just one god now, and he gives us everything we need. In this life and the next. Hey, hold on. Excuse me. 
child with that howling. Unhand me, fiend! What will become of my virtue? Now we keep our wits about us.
Ready. We are safe enough to walk, I think. Aren't we? Oh, what a thrill! My heart is racing! Be glad it still beats at all. Your screaming drew half the guards in Colchester down upon us. I wanted to give a good performance. My father always said I was quite the actor. I won't deny your enthusiasm. Did you not have even a little fun? To steal away a princess. It did give a thrill. A woman fights bravely against her abductors. Yet, what will they do with me now? Is my virtue safe with you? It's not in danger, if that's what you mean. Come now, Eivor. You can stand against Alfred's brutes, but you shudder at a maiden's gentle teasing?
It is done. And all that stands between me and my home now is a foaming ribbon of surf and silt. You did well, Rolo. You and your people. Are you ready to sail? Loki's hissing sun churns the waters between our coasts. We'll need time to rest as we wait for fairer weather. Have a care, then. Alfred's soldiers will be looking for Estrid, even if Beerstens will not. Now's not the time for such worries, eh, Four? Tonight, we celebrate! Let's get you some mead. Beerstan will meet you northeast of Colchester tomorrow. You have earned all my husband promised, and more. Come find me, if you like, away from these reveling Danes. Thor's thunderous hammer! That was I should find Beerstan. No doubt he's hunting again. Yes! <laughs> A ruse worthy of the trickster note. They're even stolen by us mere mortals. Örlítið þýshjálmi. Muni vera þungt og höfugt. Það...